All right, let's get some tools out of here. There's the special snake catching tool. Come here. The good thing about this hook is I can bend the wire to whatever angle, like so. And there we have a tool designed specifically for it. See all that tin and shit over there in the pond? It's what is here. What's going through the spongy stuff this in there? What's going through its mind? If mm. it comes out, we're gonna eat it. So we probably leave coming out to the last resort. Yep. Tell you what, once you smell these things you wouldn't want to eat them. It's freaking stink. What does he put off like a bloody? Oh what it is is they have a gland at their bum which secretes a musky smell but also because they're a frog eater basically all the frog eaters have their poo stinks a lot so. Oh yeah. But these guys, these guys are probably the worst. It's definitely the sort of snake you don't handle when you've got a hang out I tell you. <laughs> this goes under a couple of feet there. I'm just wondering how hollow it is to go, if you can go up the wall at all. Uh-huh, just need some movement there. Let's get a shovel so you can pull a bit away from the front thing, mate. I don't even want to have to in a sec. Because my theory is not working and he may have found, oh, that's a bit spongy, see that goes a couple of feet up in the corner. Oh, he, he may have just jammed himself up as hard as he can in there yep. to get away from all this drama. Yeah, he might have to get a shovel and dig away yep. at it. 